Okay, if, if, if I could change my gender, if I can be a woman, and then an hour later, if I decide I'm not a woman anymore, I guess I would lose Article Three standing. Tell me, does that same principle apply to other protected characteristics? For example, I'm, I'm an Hispanic man. Could, could I decide I was an Asian man? Would, would I have the ability to be an Asian man and challenge Harvard's discrimination? Ted Cruz is so dumb, it almost seems like it's on purpose. In fact, disliking Ted Cruz seems to be the thing that can unite just about anyone. And you you don't seem like a Ted Cruz fan? No, I just thought he showed his true colors when they had the freeze in Texas and he took his children down to what Aruba or whatever while his state was freezing. He kind of ran away during yeah. a difficult time for exactly. his state. Exactly, and he got caught and called out. So, oh no, I was just taking my kids down there. It's another, you know, come on. And uh, what about Ted Cruz? Yeah. Yeah, he's a strange guy. Uh, all right, well, thank you so much. Yep. Cruz is very unsettling to look at. And who can blame anybody, conservative or liberal, when he's going around making weird race switching hypotheticals to prove his points or trying to justify American slavery. But the left doesn't tell you, listen, was slavery horrific? Yes. Yes, okay, I'm with you so far. Slavery is the original sin of the United States of America. Did indescribable murders and tortures occur under slavery? Yes. Yeah, uh-huh, still with you. What the left doesn't tell you is America is not unique in slavery. In fact, most societies throughout history, slavery has been a significant component of it, whether in Europe, whether in Africa, whether in Asia. Slavery has been consistent for millennia. Just because other people did and do bad things doesn't justify when you do bad things. What is unique about America is not slavery. Tragically, that's been much of human existence. What's unique about America is emancipation. What's unique about America is that we wrote into our founding documents, the Declaration of Independence says, we hold these truths to be self-evidence that all men are created equal. What you're insinuating is that we viewed black people as equals back then under the phrase all men. What you're conveniently forgetting is that in America, we reduced black people to a fraction of a person and referred to them as property. Therefore, not allowing them to be a part of the all men are created equal phrasing. Nice try, though. He's an ineffectual leader who doesn't seem to have a lot of intellectual prowess, so it's really no surprise that we can find people booing him anywhere he goes, really. You, you racist piece of shit! You! You, man! You suck! You fucking suck, dude! You're a disgrace! You go to fucking hell, man! No matter how divided we all get on either side of the aisle, it's nice to know there's one thing that can unite all of us, our hatred of Ted Cruz. Thank you so much for watching. If you got something out of this video, please like it, share it, consider subscribing to The Breakdown on YouTube, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.